You know what I was telling my coworker? Uh-uh. I want to see someone like laugh their ass off, but then cry after. Like, <laughs> and then just go out. <laughs> I want to see someone laugh their ass off, and they accidentally shit themselves. <laughs> Dude, that could happen. Do it, Justin. <laughs> and I'm going like, <laughs> <laughs> and we're live. What's up, guys? I'm Alex. I'm Subs. I'm Tony. And you're watching. I mean, you're tuning <laughs> on those compadres. Compadres, compadres. Com- <laughs> compadres. That is C-O-M-P. O-D. O-D. <laughs> R-E-S. <laughs> and hopefully, we don't get cut off again. Oh, my God. Yeah. Hopefully not. Whose fault is it? I don't know. That's crazy. <laughs> I guess we'll never know. I guess we'll never know. Cut it, Tony. <laughs> with you Nikki, bro. <laughs> not man, why you guys always say that bro bro i picked him up today and i'm like hey what's up man i'm like damn bro i'm tired as fuck he's like dude me too i'm like bro you don't do shit bro he just <laughs> sit down all oh, just... he does is trade <laughs> no, that's... <laughs> that's hey, what I said. you know what i won't bash on your career <laughs> i might have a lambo next year <laughs> <laughs> four i don't got shit on me just so you guys know i'm not a bum he, he's you had a not, what? I'm not a bum. Oh. What you thought he said? I, I thought he said that I'm I'm not with bum. I don't know what he said. <laughs> just nothing went to what he said. <laughs> yeah, I just I just didn't hear. I, I don't know, dude. It's been a long day, been bro. Long day. Do I have like maybe four to three cups of coffee? Damn. Yeah. Filled. To the brim? Yeah. It was, why? I was tired, bro. I don't know why. Oh, yeah. I do know why. <laughs> I took three gummy melatonin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah bro i took three gummies yesterday wait Fuck. before you went to bed yeah why i can't sleep can you tell <laughs> these bags so you popped three gummy melatonin yeah because i've i've done one but uh-huh. now it's like my tolerance is going tolerance high. Is too high <laughs> yeah <laughs> Man, I you're gonna need two. a tolerance break soon dude i don't know i'm gonna have to go to rehab <laughs> yeah, I'm taking three now. What are you in here for? You take them every day? No, not every day. Oh, I, I was gonna I say, I think that's bad for you. Is it? Yeah, it is if bad you if take you take it every day. day. Why? Well, what happens? Because basically, <laughs> what just... happens, doctors? <laughs> You're I just think... building up a tolerance, and then now you like, there's nothing that can really oh. help you sleep. Okay. Oh yeah, like okay, I know what you. Mean. You remember? You remember the one time I got sick as fuck? That's when I still had the cruise, and uh, I bought a bottle of Nyquil. You were there. We were in the fucking um, parking lot for Walmart, and I ended up, like, drinking the whole entire bottle of NyQuil. Wait, all in one chug? Not all in one oh. chug, but, like, throughout, like, that night, I was drinking the NyQuil to make myself feel better. Mm-hmm. And then I remember, like, I went to sleep, and then, like, I had, like, these weird, like, I would feel like my heart would stop breathing like <laughs> beating breathing, breathing. <laughs> I, I felt like my heart stopped beating so then i would wake up and be like oh, <laughs> like that and i'm like holy fuck so then i think that night i just stayed up for the rest of the night because i was like i was scared You're that scared. i was i was scared that i was gonna die and then i was like searching <laughs> You ever like have like a pain in your chest or something? And and you search like, it up. Did you search it up and you're like, why does my you're chest gonna, hurt? You're gonna die in seven days. Bro, and I was like, can you die from drinking a whole bottle of Nyquil? Yeah. And they were like, yeah. Yo, you know what's crazy about those searches? Is why that, would you drink a whole bottle? Be, bro, I don't know Pickle. why. I was just trying to feel better, <laughs> and I, I don't know, dude. I was just. I take one of those and I'm out, bro. I, I took the whole bottle. That's crazy. <laughs> Yeah, you you died, <laughs> you died, and you came I, I back. I need two, like two shots of it. Two shots. Yeah, I cannot do the one. Nah, one and I'm good, and I get the best sleep of my life. Must be nice. You know, I'm scared to do that on the work day because I feel like I'm not gonna wake up on time the next day. Yeah, that happens a lot. I feel like that. That's. I think it's probably happened to me. Would you give your kids like Nyquil or like melatonin, just to knock them out? Just to knock them out. Yeah. I would. If I had a long day, bro, and they don't just stop. And they won't shut the fuck up. Yeah. I'd be I'll like, be... yo, take this real quick. Yeah. 
Be like daddy. Mmm, very good. <laughs> yep. And then leave him there. Duermete, cabrón. I won't even put him in this bed. I'd leave him there. <laughs> no. he's, he's, in, he's in the kitchen floor. It's tiles. He's <laughs> He'd be like, yeah, now you know how it feels. <laughs> I was going to say about those searches is that when you're searching up, like, these questions that you feel and everything, like, like it the web, finishes the web it for you. Or there's other questions that are similar oh, yeah, to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. It makes you think, like, damn, what are, what are people going through? <laughs> I'm not the only one. I'm kind of glad, though, because then it's like, you know, like, they have multiple other, like, questions for you. And they're like, well, does this hurt? And I'm like, yeah. Yes, it does. Does it look red? <laughs> does it look red? Yeah. yeah. And then it's like, cancer. And you're like, whoa, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Go back. Go, Go back. back. Yeah. Let me restart the reset. <laughs> Let me, uh, do it. And then what sucks is because I don't have health insurance. So I have to depend on Google to oh, tell me what dude. I have. That's so then I'd be like, I have a cold, my throat hurts, I have a fever, and I'm like, oh, uh, you know, what's Hold going up. on? You know how, I mean, I don't, I don't think any of us have health insurance, right? I do. <laughs> for, for Lucky <laughs> bastard. <laughs> for work, though, right? Yeah, for work. Yeah, yeah. I was going to say, like, has there ever been a time, like, when you didn't have health insurance? Oh, yeah. And then, like, you are you feel bad or some, something's going on with your body. Uh-huh. And, and you're just like, you know what, fuck it. I'll take the bill. I need to go to the hospital. Mm. No, never done that. No. I depend on the Mexican brujeria to fix me. Vaporú, vaporú, nah. el spray, el spray, <laughs> for real, el aceite. The, there, there was one time that I had a, I had to go to the emergency room because I forgot what was going on, dude. I was working at Potbelly still, and I couldn't walk. Like I felt like I had a pain <laughs> near my balls. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm not going to say what they did to me <laughs> in the hospital, but essentially I went there. Point is I have one nut. <laughs> <laughs> no, I went there and um, I remember whatever. They were just like, yeah, you have an ingrown hair in your inner thigh. And I was like, damn, bro, what the fuck? So I'm like, what do I do? And they're like, well, you have to see a specialist so they can like cut it. And so then they can whatever, like help you. Yeah. I'm like, oh, fuck. I'm like, all right, bet. So then uh, I picked up my mom on Monday from the airport and then she's like what's wrong mijo like what's going on and i'm like bro i'm in so much fucking pain right now like my balls were hurting so fucking bad i couldn't fucking walk i was like dude this shit is literally the fucking worst and then finally on tuesday she's like we gotta take you to the emergency room because it's bad so i ended up going Did your mom see it yeah my mom ended up seeing it. she kept on being like let me see let me see and i was like hell nah bitch what the f-? <laughs> Hell no. I was like, hell no, you got me fucked up. I ain't letting you see that. And she's like, soy tu madre, okay? Yo te parí. And oh, I was like, yeah. yo lo vi cuando estaba así de chiquito. Yo, yeah. yo, <laughs> and I'd be like, and I'd be like, mom, what the fuck? Like, dude, relax. Like, I'm 20. I was, I think I was like, I think I was 20 at the time, yeah. actually. And how uh, old are you now? 24. Damn. Yeah. That's four years. So then, no. <laughs> Oh, but did you forget about time dude like time just flies I mean, now yeah. so yeah she ended up taking me to the emergency room and then they put me under and they were like uh, I think the specialist who I was supposed to see he comes in he's like they put you under like under anesthesia and everything yeah under anesthesia and everything. so you were you were asleep yeah I was knocked out Shlong. dude I always try nice. you ever been you ever I've always wanted to try that I've never you've never been, been under anesthesia no let me tell you something they're gonna tell you to count backwards from 10 <clears throat> and uh, it depends on how quick you are like some people like the anesthesia won't work and yeah. then you can go under surgery and like remember the whole thing but not feel it sometimes you can sometimes you can and sometimes you can yeah nope i've heard if you eat blueberries before you go under that you'll remember everything the fuck were yeah. you researching it before <laughs> no i i've i found so scary. <laughs> i found this Google. out <laughs> no i found this Things out not to do bro what the, bro what the fuck i wouldn't eat Nah, I would not eat blueberries and then be like, oh, yeah, I, I remember I saw the doctor fucking... Nah, dude, I can't do that shit. I'd be uh, like, oh, my God. Dude, it'd be like a nightmare. I yeah. fucking, like, can't move and shit like that, but I can see everything. That'd be fucking weird. Bro, I've been on that, but I wasn't under, remember? I saw everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> my lung yeah. surgery. Oh, yeah. But, you were saying- but um, yeah, bro, finally, like, the specialist that I was supposed to see, he, like, before he I went under, he, like, looked at me. He's like, damn, what the fuck, dude? He's like... Bro, this is bad. He's like, you should have came in on Monday. 
And I was like, dude, they told me to call on Monday to see you. And then they told me to come on Wednesday. And he's like, this is straight up what he looks. He looks at me and he goes, my bad, dude. They shouldn't have done that. And I was like, Damn. bro, what happens if I, it would have been worse? You know what I'm saying? And I remember when I woke up from the anesthesia, I felt like, <laughs> I felt like, um, like Mason from Black Ops. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're like, where are the numbers, Mason? Hands, yeah, right? yeah. I remember I woke up and I'm like, where the fuck am I? Oh, fuck. What the fuck? I'm like, and then the ladies were like, calm down, relax. And I'm like, nah, bitch. I'm like, who the fuck are you? And Because I forgot, dude, the, the weird thing about anesthesia is that you literally feel like you lose track of time. Like the moment they put you under and you're like, all right, count back from 10, you know, and you're like 10, 9, and you're out. Right. And then you don't like you black out, bro. You don't remember anything. And then the moment you wake up is when they're waking you up from the surgery or from whatever. You're like, hey, get up. (laughs) And you you gotta go. bro. And you have like no idea what's going on the first couple seconds. Yeah. Yeah. And then they have to remind you or you have to remind yourself that you're like, dude, I was in the hospital and I went to go get surgery. And it's fucking crazy because it's like. Yeah, that's true. Cause... Like people can knock you out, like with uh, fuck, uh, what's that thing? The in the movies, you know, they put the fucking liquid on the uh, oh uh, 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 on the rag, and then the chlor- I know not, what it's called. It's not chloroform, is it? I think it is. It's chloroform. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> don't, I think it is chloroform. Don't quote though. me on that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't want to get hit in the. He comments. was so sure. <laughs> but yeah, bro, it's like imagine that or like when you like if someone roofied you yeah and you like have no idea what happened and dude it's like 12 hours or that's, however long that's actually crazy because i remember i they told me to move to the to the hospital thing i mean to the to the bed where they operate you and everything yeah dude, and it was cold right and um <clears throat> that's when they they made me count backwards but they made me count like from start so they just said count all the way to 10 and i did and then little by little i had no control when i was counting like I was, I knew I was slowing down, but I had no control over it. And I remember I just, I knocked out, and I, I don't remember after that. Like I just blacked this out. This was too. for your lung? No, this is for my other surgery, the first one I had. My lung was the second one, but um, this is when I got when I was in elementary. Uh, yeah, something like that. But anyway, yeah, fucking, I woke up, but they told me before I got surgery that I was gonna be really tired. And just fatigued. I didn't wake up like that. So I, mm-hmm. I remember I just they. I heard I heard someone say like Alex, Alex, and it was my mom. Yeah. And that's when she was like, just kind of waking me up. And then I opened my eyes, but dude, I could not for the life of me, I could not keep them up. And uh, I ended up knocking out again. And I woke up again in the hallway, and I knocked out again. Damn. And then, and then I woke up finally, but I was still I was still drowsy and everything. But I had to move beds. They had to move me. Yeah. And that's when I was still, like, up. And I was, that's when I was like, oh, shit, I had surgery. So you remember yeah. in, like, little increments, like, little yeah. short, like, little yeah. movie clips. Yeah. Because, you know, that's like, crazy. like you, um, it's not like someone's just, like, you know, how much you want. Like, 30%. Like, you have to become a. Drug this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> you got to be a, you got to become an anesthesiologist. And then you actually you have. You know they make good money? They do. But the thing is, is that you also. Like, out of all the people who work in the medical field, they have the biggest chance of getting sued. Because oh, yeah. even before, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah cause even before you put them, like, even before you get the surgery, obviously, you got to put the anesthesia. And either you don't put enough, and they remember the whole entire thing. And either the person can be cool about it and be like, yeah, like, that was pretty dope. I got to see, like, you guys operate on me. Like, but there's going to be something. Like, if that happened to me, bro, I'd be fucking pissed, bro. I'd be like, dude, that was a fucking nightmare. I was literally under for however long watching you guys fucking dissect me like that shit could be haunting you know what i'm saying Dude, imagine the doctors that do yeah it. like the surgeons and then and then like, if you give them too much they could die yeah if you if you give them too much anesthesia they can die so that's why some people would rather just go through the whatever without any without anesthesia fuck that but then you're experiencing well they'll give you like numbing pain and shit like that but like You'll still feel, like, obviously, like, you know, all the times where they're like, I'm going to put numbing cream on you. And then you still feel, like, whatever the yeah, fuck they're doing yeah. on you. So you know what I'm saying? They, gave, they were like, we're going to numb you right away. And then they sh- they gave me, like, two shots here. And they ru- and they were rubbing it. And I swear to God, five minutes later, they're like, all right, we're going to start. And I felt everything, bro. 
And I told him, I'm like, I still feel that. <laughs> no. I feel like the biggest thing that I went through is uh, as a kid, I had a lot of cavities. Uh-huh. Oh, and, my God. Yeah. Um, I had to go, like, every Friday for, like, two months. Damn. To the yeah. dentist. Yeah. And they had to, like, like you know, have, you, you guys seen the big needles at the dentist, bro? Oh, like, yeah. To get it right into, like, your nerves and your jaw. Yeah. Every Friday. Damn. Every oh, Friday. So you were like, <laughs> every yeah, Friday. dude. Yo, I remember I used to play with my cheek knowing that I can't feel it. And I'd I used to drink water. The fuck out of it. Oh, do I drink it water? And then, like, <laughs> dude, when I would drink water, my lip would, like, I was literally so blessed to still alone. <laughs> Adrian! 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 Change the channel! That shit's the worst, bro. Yeah. And no se te quita after like, what, maybe three, four hours, maybe? Yeah, yeah, it takes, it takes a while. I hate that shit. Hey, uh, quick question for you, Alex. What? <clears throat> Alex? <laughs> Sorry. I've heard that name in years. <laughs> What's the mention? Why, uh... Why is this our first podcast? Why didn't we release it on Halloween? <laughs> Shit. Oh. <laughs> what? I was about to go off. <laughs> I don't know. What happened? I don't know, man. So, <clears throat> hold up. Oh, what? This, th- <laughs> this uh, are we calling it a podcast or podcast? Vodcast. This podcast has been going on for what? Two weeks? No. Like, no. Like three. Are you talking about like if we started or we like, us three? Us, yeah, us three. Oh, well, shit. it was first. <laughs> it was first us. It expanded. It expanded. It's family now. And um, we were trying to, dude. We've been trying. Point to, is, there's so dude, much. You're gonna cut me off, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna fucking cut, bro. We've been trying to film, and, and and we've been trying to release it on Halloween. You're we trying to do a Halloween <laughs> special. That was the fucking goal. But now. But now we're in the holiday season. <laughs> yep. So anyway, <laughs> holiday seasons. <laughs> <laughs> so are you guys excited? Fuck yeah, dude! Did I tell you guys about? Class? Yeah, I know why you're fucking excited. Because right. you got a fucking girlfriend, you prick. No. I'll... Okay. Besides Hold that, up. what'd you guys do for Halloween? Um, a lot. <laughs> I had parties back to back, low key. Damn, for real. Yeah, like family. Did you end up doing the? Thing. You didn't do the costume. No, I didn't. I was, I, I was supposed to go. Have you guys seen Shrek? Um, my girlfriend was supposed to go as a Lord Farquaad. Lord Farquaad, and I was supposed to go as the guy that says, "Pick three, pick number three, my lord." <laughs> Sadly, that didn't happen. <laughs> but nah, bro, he went as the Batman. Yeah. And when he picked me up, I Justice was like, League. <laughs> "Bro, I was telling him, I'm like, bro, why didn't you tell me? Because then I could have gone as the Joker." And he's like. He looks at Kelly, he's like, I fucking told you this bitch was going to say it. And I was like, yeah, bro. Cause, and then he was like, because my check still didn't clear from Abt, right? So I was like, no. dude, fuck, man. Because I was supposed to go, like, right after to go get my costume. Yeah. And he texted me. He's like, yo, if you need money, let me know. And I was like, nah, bro, I don't want to, like, get money from you to buy a costume, whatever. Yeah. So then I'm like, bro, if you would have told me, yo, I'm going as the Batman, then I would have been like, yeah, of course. Let me go as fucking Joker then. Mm-hmm. But nah. Piece of shit over here decided to go as. I just didn't tell him, but hey, I offered. I so offered. who'd you go as? I, I, dude, bro, Sebastian. <laughs> Hold on, no. <laughs> when in doubt, cholo it out. Uh, with tight end shorts. <laughs> if you're broke, cholo it out, bro. Every, I've, been, I've been a cholo once. Everything was good, but I think his shorts were just a little too high. Dude, they were not high, bro. <laughs> they They're were lower high. than my other shorts for sure. And they were they were tight. Yeah, most knuckle tight. I was I was looking the whole time, Damn. but I had a camel dick. Batman doesn't tell me. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> anyways, the holiday, <laughs> the holiday season. <laughs> fuck yeah, I'm ready. Do you guys know there's gonna be a Black Friday or not? What? A Black Friday? Yeah, there's if there's going to be. Yeah, I yeah. think so. Then the my boy answer? over here. A B T. Apt. 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 Yeah, yeah. You call it A B T because. Now he'll go. He'll bro, go it's just like I still want to say ABT, but they're always like it's apt, and I'm like, okay, bro, apt. Why is, do you do it to us? Because they do it to me. I gotta do it to somebody. What the fuck? Um, yeah, I guess they are doing a Black Friday, but I think they did it last year too. But it wasn't as big as like every other year because of COVID and shit like mm. that. So, but apparently, yeah. So I mean, are you guys gonna ball out? 
Probably not, dude. Probably not. Yeah. I always say that I'm gonna ball Depends. out. Depends. If, if like we hopefully find an apartment, mm-hmm. then I might go like for like appliances, Dang. like TV. I mean, you always find the best deals for TV. Yo, like Walmart. A... Walmart has some cheap TVs. They do. Yeah, they've but, always had. Look, they're not. Uh, they're not good quality though. Yeah, that's true. They're like off brands, like RSA or Vizio. Hey. It's okay. Still a TV. <laughs> nah, bro. Dude, my oh, grandma fuck. still has a Vizio. Yo, that shit, yeah, and it's still lasting. Yeah, that shit lasts. That shit does last. Damn, man. shit. Maybe I just, maybe I gotta stop by your local Walmart and <laughs> go get myself a plasma. Yeah, it's like two hundred bucks for like a seventy-five inch TV. Yeah, dude, cheap. At App, they're like fucking three grand, two grand for it. Damn. But so you know like, what? I, you know what I just had? Uh, Chocolate abuelita. Ooh. <laughs> hey, thanks with some inv- conchas? I had, I had Bro, some thanks bo- for the invite. I had oh, some man, Sorry, it was just for me. I made some for myself. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, it was. I'll give you some of the chocolate. I have it. Then why don't you make it? Because he got I, no milk. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I just, My mom hasn't been home for two weeks. <laughs> nah, I just, I completely forgot that I had it low-key. You just oh. reminded me. Yeah, this shit is fire. Damn, como conchas? No, you guys don't know what I had yesterday. What? <laughs> <laughs> it just reminded me right now when you said chocolate bolita. I had the bootleg version. Wait, well, what is it? Um, so... I wanted something warm yesterday morning, uh-huh. like I, and I, I couldn't have coffee. And then um, I put canela on the stove, and I ended up forgetting about it. So, like, all the water evaporated. <laughs> so I was like, damn, dude, I don't want to wait again. So then I got some milk from the fridge. I heated it up, mm. and then I popped out some uh, some cocoa powder <laughs> from Hershey's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. And I was like, damn, I hope this works because I've never used it before. And then yeah. I put sugar, dude, fire. It's, it's pretty good. So now you got to do it again tonight. <laughs> you know what I used to love when I used to work at Illuminati's? Mm. I used to get their coffee. But before, this is probably some fat shit, bro. But, like, my coworker, I used to drink coffee because I was just drinking, like, normal. Yeah. And my coworker is like, you never had, like, the Lou way? And I'm like, what do you mean the Lou way? And he's like, yeah, bro. He's like, you put two scoops of ice cream in there, and then you put coffee on top. And you don't have to put any milk or any sugar because the ice cream's already sweet. Mm. Bro, the first time I took a sip of that shit. Fire? Crack. Damn. Bro, that is shit was. It, is it too sweet or not? Nah, that shit was perfect, bro. That shit was fucking That's perfect. Like. That's awesome, and, I, and then, like, and then, like, obviously, like, the coffee would hit the, the ice cream. So then there'd be still, like, some little chunks left mm-hmm. of, like, the cold ice cream. Yeah. So then when Crack. you sip it, you're like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and you're just like, oh my god, dude. I'm excited, for the, like for the holiday season because of those kinds of, like of moments. Yeah, like I don't drink hot coffee or hot chocolate at all throughout the year, unless it's finally like this time. Yeah, like from I think past November, probably November or something when it gets cold, cold. Yeah, dude, it's already been getting cold. Yeah. Well, yeah, but it's not, like, to the point where, like, you have to wear, like, a hoodie and a jacket. Oh I'm not looking forward Shit. to that. That literally happened today. I had to wear this and the fucking jacket. Oh, yeah? It was cold. Today was fucking cold. Yeah, but, bro. But, oh, my God. The aestheticness. That's, the, like, it's so pleasing, too. Yeah. Like, driving here and wheeling, like, passing the, like, the police department. You see all the lights and shit like that. Yeah. And same thing in BG here. And then BG you get to here. the forest preserve and all the leaves are changing. Oh, yeah. my God. It makes me not want to go to work. But I had to go. <laughs> yeah, that's bro. the worst. Like to get up in the morning during that time. What? Like because you're so cold. comfy, bro. Yeah. Oh yeah. So you're you're comfy, covered bro. in blankets. I have that Mexican blanket, the heavy ones. <sighs> oh, that. I can't get up, dude. That one is fine. Is it? Oh, uh, the tiger. It's a lion. <laughs> oh, it's a lion. Okay, yeah, mine's yeah, a, mine's you know a buffalo. <laughs> really? Yeah. No, you know what's crazy? I've had that blanket since I was like in diapers. Really? Damn. Yeah. Well, like uh, the first my one. My grandma I, has like kept it like perfect. Damn. Yeah. The first one I had was a green one. I think it was a lion. And then I think I grew old, like grew out of it because it was pretty small. Mm-hmm. And then I had a red one. And I think it was a tiger. And I lost it. Damn. And then after that, that's when I got the buffalo one. Mm-hmm. And I've had it ever since then. Dude, those are. Those Mexican blankets are fire. Hey, bro. quick question. So, what happens if, well, obviously, for you guys, because you guys have girlfriends, right? So, let's just say that you have a Mexican blanket too, or what? No, not, not right now. Oh. Uh, all right. Well, fuck you then. Never mind. For you. Yeah. You and Rebecca move in, right? Mm-hmm. You guys get your own place. Mm-hmm. Are you going to bring that blanket? Oh, for sure. What I happened? was actually thinking, I was like, I was like, 
you know, for our first place and stuff, we can go shopping for one. Go to La Garra. <laughs> well, Fact, and pick but what happens if she doesn't want? Oh, she loves it. No, but I'm saying hypothetically, she didn't like it. Oh, then she can sleep with her own blanket. I'm going <laughs> to sleep with my blanket. So, so, but she was like, but what happens if she like, Tony, let's get rid of it. Like, it doesn't That blanket? Good. Like, it just in general, like, she doesn't like the blanket. Like, she doesn't like how it looks. You throw her away? <laughs> Who are you throwing away? The Her or the blanket? I'll tell you something right now. If I had a girl and she was like, hey, yo, I don't like that shit. That shit fucking beaner as hell. I'd be like, Pfft. Someone's getting deported, They're and gone. it's not you, bro. <laughs> and it's not the blanket. It's not the blanket. It's you, bro. Damn. What would you do? Are you going to leave her, or are you going to leave the blanket? I'm going to leave the apartment with my blanket. <laughs> <laughs> you have everything else. You can well, keep the leave. Blanket. Yo, yeah. leave me my blanket. Damn, dude. Yeah, because they don't understand, bro. That blanket... Does wonders. Do it, yeah. That shit smacks. That's a one blanket right there, and that could keep you warm for the whole night. Imagine walking around the house with it too. Oh, Oh. I can't walk around with mine. Mine's too heavy. Oh, really? Mine's like the big one. Like the long one, or just heavy? Just heavy and big. It's like for a king. Oh Oh, shit! shit. (laughs) Twin. (laughs) I got a (laughs) full. Yeah, bro, man, that shit's dope, dude. I fucking love that shit, man, dude. Do um, you guys use it all year round or do you? All work? year. Okay, yeah, me too. Damn, Damn, all fucking, year? Yeah, even bro. In the summer? Even well, in the summer, bro. I use the AC and then I Yeah, use... I use the okay, AC yeah. and I do that. I was going to say, you you leave the window open and you. That ropas con eso, dude, you're sweating. That's a sauna. Bro, but there are some times when even the AC doesn't help. For and real? I'm just like, fucking. No, because, dude, my mom loves the fucking heat, bro. Mm. Like, in the summertime, she'd be like, she's like, okay, I want to un trato. Lo vamos a dejar a 74. I'll be like, 74? It's 75 outside. <laughs> I'll be like, bro, are you fucking kidding me right now? Like, yo, I'm fucking sweating balls. Yeah, and she'll be like, I can you go know. to the lake for 74. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I'll be like, yo, I can go into the cooler for 74 right now, bro. <laughs> I need something cold. And so, like, it's kind of like an ongoing battle. So what I do, what I started to do now is I get home late, like, mm-hmm. when she goes to bed. And I can see that she... Put it at 75, bro. She wants it at 75 in this house. Mm-hmm. I tell her she's fucking crazy, dude. Especially during the summer. <clears throat> yeah. I don't know how they do that. So when I wait till she's asleep and I set it down to 70 or 69. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Perfect what perfect temperature, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Bro, I, I've already thought about this so many times, but when I get my own house and I get my own crib, it is gonna be 69 every single day for the whole entire year Damn. it's not gonna be hot it's not gonna be cold it's gonna be 69 all year cap, <laughs> cap. bro <laughs> what, cap. If, what if you move in with your girl like it's her place you oh it's her, her place yeah i'm gonna be like bro this is this is what you signed up for you signed up for 69 <laughs> Dude, what is she Damn. what is she if she's now? like bro because think about this right Going back to my mom's. No, no, no. Fuck that. I ain't going back to my mom. It's probably worse over there. But like, if you. 75. 75, bro. It's 70 here. But like, in the summertime, right? People always be like, why do you like the winter? Why do you like the winter? And I'll be like, bro, I hope you realize when it's fucking hot outside and you get butt ass naked, you still hot as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're still fucking sweaty. Yeah. You're still fucking sticky. You got you know? mosquitoes you everywhere. You got mosquitoes all over Dude, you trying to, try to we, suck you off. We live in Illinois. The humidity here is fucking insane. Like, what the fuck? But in the winter, right, when you're cold, put on some extra socks. Put on an extra pair of sweatpants. Dude. Put on an extra hoodie. Put on some. Uh, put on a hat. But you know what I'm saying? The only thing that sucks about it, though, is dudes with cars. Cause then you gotta go out there and turn that bitch oh, on. Oh my god! That's why you gotta get a remote. That's why sign. I don't got a car. <laughs> yeah, but even then, it's like you go in there and, and um, you turn it up. Oh, then you, you gotta wait. wipe. You gotta yeah, wipe just to wipe off. and everything. And even then, when you go inside your car, it's still cold. Even Bro, though the heater's. I'd on. rather have like, that shit. It's the oh shit season. Oh my yeah. god! You know what I just remembered? What? Do you guys remember my uh, my white Cherokee? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Of course you guys do. Um. So. It was like super cold. It was, we used to work at Home Depot, mm-hmm. and my heater went out. Ooh. But like, it was cold, like stupid cold. And I remember that I had to like drive, and I had to like wipe my 
my uh, my windshield off, dude. It was so bad. You know what that so reminds bad. you of? The wiping of the windshield. Yeah. I have a I have a friend who we used to drive and his wipers didn't work, so he would like grab a sock. <laughs> <laughs> and he yeah, would, I know who you're talking about. <laughs> you know who you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> he would like <laughs> he would like open the window and then he would move and he's like <laughs> <laughs> with his sock, bro. With his yeah, sock. Dude. And, um, and he would throw water because the windshield was too dirty. Oh yeah, he would throw the windshield because oh the windshield. <laughs> he threw He'd the keep water. The He'd throw the water because then it would get so dirty. And I would just remember watching him. And at that time, I didn't have a car. So, I mean, you I still like, don't. Have he has a car. <laughs> no, no, but I'd be like, bro, you're so fucking broke, dude. Like, what's Yo. wrong with you? And then he'd look at me, and be like, oh, I'm sorry. Did you want to drive? Where's your car? And I'd be like. <laughs> I bet you need help with that sock. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> he takes my mom and she's free. <laughs> yeah, man. Those are the worst, bro. You know what's crazy about this weekend? Canelo's fighting. Ooh. Canelo versus. Oh, it's this weekend? Yeah, it's this, it's weekend. this weekend. And UFC is on this weekend yeah. at the same time. Usman versus Colvington. Ooh. Are you guys going to go to uh, like somewhere to watch it? I think so. So I'm you guys sure can yet. watch both? <laughs> I was going to have it at my house, but mm-hmm. I, don't, I don't know about that. Because then I don't know who'd pay. Yeah, because yeah. that dude, that's two main events that would yeah. be paid, you know. Unless you find it on the website, but even then, it's hard because then like there's so many people trying to watch it, yeah. And so then it's like it lags out it or freezes. Heads after heads after heads. Yeah, and then it's like local milfs want to fuck, and then you're like, <laughs> you're like, mm, I can't do that right now. <laughs> people are watching, but I'll save the I'll link. Save it <laughs> I'll save it for later, <laughs> bro. When you were 13, 14 years old. And, like, well, let me ask you this. When was the first time you discovered porn? Oh. <laughs> really about to talk about this, huh? <laughs> yeah. Dude, I was, like, I'd I think say, it was Fox Point, bro. It was definitely Fox Point. I was. I feel like one of, like, the older guys, like, showed us. I was in elementary school. No, okay. Yeah. But, like, I, I meant, like, the older guys. when did you actually, like, watch porn? Yeah, I was in elementary. You were in elementary school mm-hmm. when you first got introduced to porn. Yeah. And you I, liked it. I mean, at right first, away, or did you were, were you like, what's going on? Like, yeah, at first I was like, what's going on? Like, and this, this, and that. But we were we were watching it. This is the weird part. We were watching it like if it was just a regular TV show. <laughs> <laughs> but I was just like so into it. I was like, why do I, I dude? I don't like, know why. what's going I on. Imagine, I can imagine just like I all the guys see small Chicha, yeah, just dude. sitting around. Huh? I could just see small Chicha looking at the titties and being like, oh. So that's why they call me Chichis. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I was around that age. I'd say like fourth, maybe fifth grade. Okay. No, it was it was like fourth, third grade. Did you ever click on the ads? No, oh, no, this was dude. This was like a VHS. Oh yeah, no, bro. okay. Well, yeah. then I'm talking about like when you actually went on like the hub oh, or shit. XXX videos. I'd say it was like a year later. A year, <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> bro, how do you, bro? You made it. Seem... You had one computer. Uh, <laughs> no, it was the family computer. <laughs> Oh, bro, dude, you're, a story yeah. about, you're a sick, Yo, sick fuck, We dude. had to throw away two computers because they had so much virus. <laughs> I was like, Yo, I was an animal. Bro, you're fucking <laughs> sick, and, dude. And I would try to play innocent. I know I know, I was going to look at this, but she knew. She, You know, because they would look at me and be like, just tell us the truth. Does your mom, like, did your mom know? I'm sure she knows. <laughs> dude, I yeah, thought you One was my sister's personal laptop, dude. <laughs> 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 she got that shit for her birthday and I, I trashed that shit <laughs> you cooked links on links on links on links I wanted to play the games <laughs> oh yeah sure you did cool cool math games <laughs> cool math <laughs> oh no dude boy. I thought Chicho was so cool bro cause he had the computer in his house cause like we used to like, <laughs> I used to go there in the morning and then he'd be playing like Eminem on YouTube and dude then, I wasn't shit <laughs> You're a dirty little man. <laughs> Yo, that, that YouTube page, that was just hitting, hiding the whole thing. That was just a cover up. Yo, it was. Once, once Tony knocked on the door, he put on M&M. He's like, <laughs> so, um, Antonio, come on in. Dude, it was like a routine that I mastered. I was like, oh, I know what's next. But no, nah, I thought you were the shit because you had the Xbox. Oh, yeah. Dude, but I, I was so scared to go over and play. <laughs> Her, his mom was like, only 30 minutes. <laughs> yeah, dude. The game just started. That's it. That was when the Xbox was slow, bro. No, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I exposed myself. 
I want to know what you guys, how old you guys were. I think I was in middle school. Yeah, I was in middle school. Damn, really? Yeah. Yeah. That's well. What grade? <laughs> um, I think seventh or eighth for me. Like when you searched it up yourself, you said? Like, no, I think, bro, I was a horny bastard. I was on YouTube because I didn't know where to go first. And I was just like, big booty Latinas. <laughs> and then they show me, but then I'm like, bro, this is fine. Like, there has to be more. <laughs> bro, that's what I thought. I'm like, there has to be more. Yeah. Like, I'm sure there's somewhere because, like, fuck. I remember when I used to go to the Jimenez, my mom used to buy these magazines. And then they had, like, you could pay a certain amount to make that girl your wallpaper. So then, I, <laughs> so then on your phone, so I'd just be looking at them and be like, bro, they fucking which hot. Is, which is the best wallpaper for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, bro, they fucking fine as hell, dude. And then eventually, that's when, like, my needs just started, like, going. Crazy. And I was like, bro, I need to see some titties, bro. I'm like, I don't, I don't want to see, like, as any titties. I want to see titties, you know? So, yeah, eventually. I want to see the girl in the magazines, too. <laughs> bro, like, and then my parents, I think, called me one time because we had the family computer. And then they, like, looked at the search history and they're like, what Sick is this? Fuck. Thankfully, it was only on YouTube when they first caught me. Mm. They're like, what is this? And I'm like, bro, I just like the music. I just like the way she dances. <laughs> <laughs> and so then they were like, oh. Well, no. it's better than to say it wasn't me. Yeah, well, yeah, because I'm like, well, Bro, I wasn't going to be like, yeah, I was Enrique. <laughs> Fucking, he's eight years old. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So no, then no. eventually, yeah, that's when I finally found porn. And uh, it was like, it was like a miner finding gold. <laughs> Why does this sound like we're, we're in rehab talking about <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> No, but like, bro, all the girls are probably going to watch this video. and They're going to be like, yo, what the fuck mm -hmm. is wrong with them? Maybe, maybe some of them, right? But all the guys are going to be watching this and going to be like, I feel you, brother. They're going to be like, I, I remember the you. first time. I remember my first time. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And um, I was telling Chicho, bro, like, I, I was grounded that summer. I think eighth grade going into high school. I was grounded that you summer. You can't ground a teenager. <laughs> and I had my iPod. So then, like, my dad wouldn't give me the Wi-Fi to the house. Yeah. So I would go outside and be like this. Oh, Because my, my neighbor God. had free Wi-Fi. So Do you guys remember that? Like, free the free wi Wi-Fi? Wi yeah. yeah. I remember when I had my PSP. Uh -huh. Dude, I used to, like, go to, like, my neighbor because he had the open Wi-Fi. Dude, I remember I didn't have any, like, um, service on my phone, so I'd go to your house and steal Wi-Fi. <laughs> oh, yeah. You think I wanted to chill? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. And I would just be up okay. there like a fucking dumbass, just being like, come on, come on, come on, come on. And then I'd finally get one little bar, and then after that, I'll search up, like, shit and then i'll save it to my ipod oh my <laughs> because then bro because i wouldn't find it i wouldn't be able to do it later yeah so then like i mean can't use my imagination bro what am i gonna think of i'm fucking eighth grade 13 years old what am i supposed to think you know but yeah <laughs> fucking... did you ever trash a computer <laughs> no i don't think we ever had a computer i was more slick bro damn <laughs> we're not that horny bro no, it wasn't. It wasn't that. I, was just I feel like everybody goes through that. Yeah, everybody through goes through that stage. Yeah. <laughs> I just, uh, I've been thinking about this lately. I'm still like, on I it. Wonder, <laughs> how am I gonna like catch my kids? You know what I mean? Oh, you'll know, dude. You'll know. Yeah, I know. It's, dude. I'm pretty sure our parents knew, bro. I'm pretty there's, sure. There's, there's no way. Yeah, there's no way they acted just dumb. I'm sure there was just like, I'm just. Gonna what would what, what would you do like if you caught your kid, Jack? I feel like I'd be like. I feel like I'd be honest. Like, I'd just be like, it's normal. You know what I mean? Yeah. I wouldn't yeah, want to like, avoid it because then it's just like, they're just going to avoid you. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? That's true. They won't even look at you and shit. Hey, Dad. No, hey, I, how was, just, uh, just, cool? Just lock the door. <laughs> yeah, I'll just, just say, lock the door. I'll just say that too. Like, just lock the door. And that's <laughs> it. Bro, I don't know why, but because there are some people that I know who are horny bastards. Mm-hmm. I would like not shame him, but be like, "You horny fucking bastard," and then like just, just like your dad, <laughs> and just put him on the spot, you know? Because yeah. I want, like, I want them to like, uh, you know, feel that embarrassment for a little bit, and then so then they can grow up and be like, "Yeah, man, my dad caught me watching porn one time," and I just be like, "Do I think getting bro, caught who, is just a who knows if like, w like our kids when they grow up, like if they're gonna have like that kind of experience?" What you mean? Cause bro, they might be in VR, bro. 
might be in the metaverse. It might be in meta, you know, yeah. Inside of a brothel. <laughs> You know, it's crazy. I, I had uh, at work today, these guys from Facebook came to our job. Oh, no way. And um, they were showing us the whole Oculus thing. And oh. apparently, the metaverse is actually going to be for, like, small things. It's not going to be, like, Ready Player One shit. You know, like, everybody thinks it's going to be, like, a virtual world and worlds on worlds and you can be whoever you want. I thought like, that was the point. That was I thought that was the point too, but apparently, like they said that eventually they will, but that won't be for years to come. Right now, oh, it's I'm just sure. for like people to like hang out and like do whatever. work from home and stuff. work from home and shit like that. And I'm that's just dumb. like, I'm like, all right, I mean that's cool okay, and all, you <laughs> but at the same I'm time, I'm like, all my Facebook stock. <laughs> but don't don't say like, oh yeah, we're creating a multi like a a, vid- a virtual reality well, shit. That's what they made it seem like. That yeah. it's gonna be like a freaking whole like you said, worlds on worlds, bro. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm like, bro, I was ready to be in part of that shit. You know what I'm saying? I thought I was gonna, I was gonna be some mafia type of motherfucker and. And just run the streets and then hop off and be like, gotta go to ABT, guys. <laughs> apt, it's apt. I gotta go to Ab. <laughs> I, I said ABT for you guys, all right? But I know it's Ab. Uh, yeah. yeah. so for, like for us in the audience. For us in the audience. It's Ab. It's Ab, bro. Not ABT. Is there even other AB? A- a- uh, no, other Ab? I think that's the only one, right? It's the only one in America. Oh, shit. And so, it's, it's the number one uh, appliance store in the country. Because of you. Well, I'm not gonna We're not say. sponsored by. I ain't gonna say it's because of me. Well, you know, we would like to get if, those cool vests that Sebastian has. If the owners are watching, please don't fire me. <laughs> I really need this job. But yeah, bro. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> like I really need. It. I don't want to be a stock trader. Bro, you know what's been going on on the internet? If you knew. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be a stock. Trader. <laughs> yeah, it's hard. Yeah, I bet it is, bro. I, I, I would have no fucking idea what they're doing. I see green, <laughs> making money. You know what? You know what's been going on on the internet too. There's been a lot of leaks on, on the new Spider-Man movie, mm. and I've been trying to avoid, bro. But I just click away, and I look at Is it. This the one with the uh, the new one coming out. Oh, okay, bro. They it shows each each fucking leak that I've seen are showing the three Spider-Mans in there. Which one? There. Well, there was like the, the You've costume. been avoiding all the spoilers and <laughs> Sebastian is Dude, about to spoil it. Like, I've been, I know if, there, if there's going to be a second trailer, because there is, I'm going to avoid that. But all these leaks and everything, the only reason I'm looking at it is because what if someone's just making it up? What if it's not real? Some are actually like confirmed. Yeah. Right? But then there's others that it, it, it's cool to see, but I, I just, I don't want to believe that it is, you know, till I see the movie. I'm just saying, bro, there is no way. Like, I, there is no way that they are adding William Dafoe, mm-hmm. uh, the original Doc Ock. But they are. I oh, know. Hold on. Hold on. I hold on, let me finish. Let me get to it. I said there's no fight. way that they're gonna be adding those two characters: oh, okay. Sandman, uh-huh. Electro, Sandman? yeah, wow. Electro and Lizard, mm-hmm. right? Three villains from the original. Um, three villain. Uh, three villains from the original. Uh, Tobey Maguire movies, and two villains from the Amazing Spider-Man movies. And you cannot fucking tell me you're not going to put in Toby and fucking Andrew Garfield, bro. There's no it's, fucking way, bro. Yeah. Like, you, if if they don't like, and I've said this before, and I've said this to you, right? If they don't do this, if they don't add those two motherfuckers into this movie. They are missing out on the biggest, the biggest money opportunity they have ever, yeah. ever come across, bro. Mm-hmm. Spider-Man No Way Home will be the biggest superhero movie possibly of all time. I mean, it already, dude, the fucking, um. The trailer, the first trailer beat Endgame and yeah. Infinity War views. It's the most talked movie for sure. Anticipated movie for sure to end the year. I disagree. It has to. You don't think it's gonna be the biggest superhero movie of all time? Oh, superhero! Yeah, I thought I thought you guys meant like movie in general. No, 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 no. not movie. No, not superhero movies. movie. Yeah, there'll be bigger movies. What about the Matrix? I'm not excited for it. I'm excited for John Wick Four. That shit's gonna that, go crazy. No. John Wick. You know what I'm excited for? No way home. I'm excited for the Batman movie too. Ooh, yeah. I think do I think Robert Pattinson's gonna kill it. I don't know why. I have a feeling he's gonna do a good job. I don't know. 
You know, when when he was first casted, when it was announced, I was like, him? That's, yeah, that's what but we had, the same feeling. After a while, I was like, okay, I, I think I could see it. You know, that mm-hmm. seriousness in him and everything else, I could see it. But I guess him just being from the movie Twilight. But there's, and there's, there's some, like, uh, actors that are... It's cause, because Robert Patterson was in Twilight for so long. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know yeah. what I mean? So there's there's some actors that, like, have been in movies or sequels that have like that are so long that they kind of just you see that person and that's what you see oh yeah like uh, you see vin, twilight like vin diesel you know like to, uh, him, when i see vin diesel i think toretto or know? john cena because john, oh, yeah, john cena john cena fucking um robert downey jr I, I every single time i think of john cena i think about if movie wise the soldier Oh, the Marine. The Marine. The Marine. The yeah. Marine, yeah. The Marine. But other than that, John Cena, just WWE wrestler. Johnny Depp, bro. See, that's weird, though. Johnny Depp is like... Johnny Depp, you can't really pinpoint one movie. He has you a lot can, of good movies. You can say Pirates yeah. of the Caribbean, but that's still not his best movie. I think he's just well known from it, though. Yeah, he well... But when you think about Johnny Depp, for me at least, I don't think about Pirates of the Caribbean. Mm-hmm. I think about all the other movies he's been in. Other than that, like, just the characters that he's played, you know? Robert think... Downey Jr., yeah, Iron Man for sure. But he was also really good in Zodiac. Sherlock you Holmes. You know, Sherlock Holmes. Oh, that was a good movie. Um, Sherlock Holmes. He was the one with uh, Zach Galifianakis. Oh, Due Date? Yeah, Due Date, yeah. I mean, the, yeah, he's had good movies. But the sure. one movie, for sure, um, Steve Rogers. Um the fucking uh, Captain Chris America, Evans? yeah, Chris Evans, uh-huh. yeah, Steve Rogers. He's, I mean, I, I mean, Captain America. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. But, um, with Johnny Depp, when when his name comes up, for some reason, I think Pirates of the Caribbean, and because growing up that shit was really trending, mm. and Willy Wonka. Even though I've never seen Willy Wonka or Pirates of the Caribbean. Those are the two movies that I think you know, about I've never more. seen Pirates of the Caribbean either. I've never seen yeah. Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, but I feel like if I get into it, Bro, then I'll probably get I've into been, it. Yeah. I was trying so fucking hard to find the movies and watch them because for, for some reason, I was just singing the fucking... I don't know why. It was just getting me into the fucking mood, but... There's, yeah, man. I mean, Edward, Edward Scissorhands. Too. <laughs> Edward oh, Scissorhands. yeah, Edward Scissorhands. I He's also about Rango. Never seen it. Ringo? Yeah, the, the oh lizard. the, the, the okay. chameleon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he's Rango. He's. I thought, uh, I thought you said the Django. Oh uh, no, no, that's a good movie. Oh yeah, Django. Django. Oh, yeah. I remember the first time we watched it, we were at uh, Jesus's house, and it was just you and me, I think, and we got high <laughs> as fuck, dude. Watching we got, Django. Yeah, watching Django. It was so weird because like Jesus's fucking house or his room was filled with just like posters and shit like that such like a cool vibe to yeah be in. it was yeah and then like <laughs> next thing you know he's like y'all want to get high and we're like all right well fuck it let's get high so we got high and then he's like you ever watch fucking Django? and i was like i've never fucking watched <laughs> Django before dude and he's like bro dry mouth <laughs> <laughs> drink as much water as you can and still on. be dry give me a second Dude, the first time I, ah, the first time I ever got high shit. was with Jesus and you. That was, and that was in, I would think we were still in high school. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I was eating bond that didn't work no more, candy oh that wasn't God. working. Wait, who did I, because I remember uh, smoking on the roof for some reason. That I don't know if it was only with you that guys. That wasn't with me. No. no. You you were like, oh, we should smoke on the roof. And then that's when Jesus was like, nah, if it's his first time, <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. good thing we didn't, bro. I would have jumped off for sure. But... Dude, Dude, your first time, bro, that was, I oh was my god, that was so hilarious, bro. <laughs> so funny, dude. Dude, I swear to god, I thought it lasted the whole day. That shit was only like two, three hours. Bro, yeah, I remember when you first get high, you just feel like, you get high as fuck. You're high as fuck for me, like, the first hour, and then the next hour, you're just fucking slumped. Dude, yeah. You're just like, uh, and you're just like, yo, fuck, dude. I remember, I remember after that long journey it was long for me um we were walking home and then i was so excited i was like tony i just smoked and he was i think he was still feeling it and he was like yeah man (laughs) bro i never understand because when i would smoke with lalo and chris it was like for me it lasted for hours i was high as fuck you know i think i think you and me are very similar 
Cause I don't like I don't like getting high. I don't like getting high either. Cause it, 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 like I feel like ever since like the beginning when I first like started, I feel like I did it just to be cool. <laughs> yeah, I did but, it just to be cool too. But like, it, it, I don't know. I never liked it. It's now, always got me paranoid, just like, anxiety, yeah. and I'm just now like, when people are like, dude, you don't smoke weed, and I'm like, nah, bro. And they're like, why? And I'm like, cause I don't need to. And they're like, what the fuck's wrong with you? And I'm like, they're like, so you just live life like like that? Dude, I don't know how people do it. I don't know how people like smoke every day. Yeah, yeah I can't do it. Cause every it's day. like, dude, me. This is already so high, bro. I, I don't know, bro. I, I, even I, I then, can't like, function. Even I if their function. tolerance wasn't high, right, and they still got the same effects as they normally would. Mm -hmm. Like for me, it's just like, bro, like I I wouldn't be able to do it every single day. Like that's like for me when I get high, I have to plan. <laughs> Like, I have to know that I'm not doing shit for a good couple hours. Yeah, true. me too. <laughs> and even then, probably, like, after I'm done smoking, I'm, like, done for the day. <laughs> like, I have no energy to do anything else other just than just, home. like, just chill <laughs> on yep. my bed and, like, probably just knock out eventually. Oh, so, like, but, I mean, sometimes I do like getting high and, like, playing Call of Duty. It just makes me, f I don't know why. I mean, sometimes I do really good and sometimes I just fucking suck, so... It just depends. I but. hit the pen that I have, and that just that just relaxes me. It doesn't even get me high anymore. It just gets it gets me relaxed, and I just chill mm. instead of having to be like, "Dude, am I gonna sleep tonight? Why does my back hurt?" And this, this, and that. No, I've never been able to do that. Wait, no? wait, wait, wait. Can I say something? <clears throat> On the last podcast that we talked about, <clears throat> this this topic for me is very important, and I, from the bottom of my heart. I want everybody who's watching this to know I am dead serious. About what? To this day, and to the day I die, until it finally comes out, I will always, always believe in fucking dragons. Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> and I want to make this very known, all right? I don't care if, I made fun, if I'm made fun of, okay? I don't care, all right? I'm telling you right now. Fucking now. If there's either a Godzilla like monster living in the bottom of the ocean or a fucking lizard with wings that breathes fire, That's I want funny. everybody to know. Every everybody on this table to know as well. Y'all can suck my fucking dick, dude. <laughs> Every single one of you that made fun of me for, for thinking dragons weren't real, bro. There are so many creatures on this planet that we would be like, yo, how does that fucking exist, right? Mm -hmm. Do you believe in the Loch Ness Monster? Yeah. Okay, do you, live in, do you believe in Bigfoot? <laughs> yeah. So tell me this. Why I don't it, believe in dragons? Why don't you believe in dragons, bro? Bro, it's because... It, what? Know. It's a giant lizard that flies around and... I haven't bro, it's fire. been in history, both in China... And in fucking uh, Europe, that a fucking lizard that flew in the sky. Well, there hasn't been sightings of it. Bro, it's probably just somebody mean? high off the Yeah, because with Bigfoot, ass. there's been sightings. But that was Longest back monster then. Okay, in. but that's what I'm saying. Back then, that was probably around. But there's still no sightings or no pictures or anything. But there's pictures of that, of what you just mentioned. Bro, how do you know that's real, though? Because I see the pictures. I'm not saying, oh, it's 100% real, oh, oh, but I'm like, look, black at least there's a, a black, picture. A black and gray photo. Show me a picture of a dragon. Bro. Without a drawing. <laughs> a black and gray photo of the Loch Ness Monster. Yeah. And Bigfoot walk, like the iconic Bigfoot yeah. walking, right? Yeah. You going to tell me that's not fake? I don't know, but at least there's pictures of it. I feel like it's something that... So if I were to show you someone who took a picture and said, yo, this could be a fucking dragon, yeah, even, if it, even if it's real or fake, would you believe me? Show, show us the picture. All right, man. I'm, I'm going to try to find... <laughs> He's going to try to find. Because there's I no... Have, no, because I haven't found it. I haven't looked it up in a row. A little... In a row. In a row. <laughs> If you are in the hunt for dragons, go to 123dragons.com. Sebastian is raising the fundraiser. Oh my god, dude. Bro. Sebs, so you're getting canceled. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, dude. No, I'm kidding. I don't care. I don't next care. next podcast, you better wear a shirt with a dragon on it. <laughs> yeah, for real. So this whole time, you better wear something with a dragon. Bro, I, I feel like that's got to be your thing. Yeah. If Bro. you believe in dragons so much, why don't you just get a tattoo? I, I would. But, but you not, have it. But, but you got a snake. But he got a bird. <laughs> and a bird. 
<laughs> okay, that's close. He got a snake he and a bird. Close. And if you combine He's still those, to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's not, there's no good pictures, okay? But I'm telling you right now, there's no, no evidence no, there, whatsoever. Bro, I'm telling you right now, man. If God loves me, and I hope He does. <laughs> 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 I I just I just really need this shit to be true, bro. I really need a dragon to be real. You don't know, like, have you ever been like wanting something so bad, and like you want to prove people right, like people wrong, you know, all the time. So like when all you finally time. do it, and you finally get it right, you can uh, finally tell those people, yo, suck my fucking dick. I did it, and I got it right. Sometimes, yeah. That's me right now. I want people to know, right? Tell them your organization, yeah, bro. bro. Yeah. yeah, they look at the real. Yeah, bro, yeah, dragons. I we believe. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I, bro. Everybody coming. We believe. <laughs> we <laughs> believe. I'm just saying, bro. <laughs> Fuck you guys, first of all. You guys are making fun of it right now. But watch. The moment they discover a fucking giant head with wings, I'm fucking slapping the <laughs> dog shit. <laughs> I am slapping the shit out of all of you guys. Every single one of you people right. who are watching this. I'll let you do it. I'll let you slap me if a dragon is Even real. my mom, bro. If my mom says that dragons <laughs> aren't real, I am slapping the shit out of her, bro. Does she know? Do you believe in it? Bro, she fucking raised me, bro. <laughs> fucking everything, every shirt that I had at one mm-hmm. point when I was a child w- had to have a dragon on it. Dude, there. if dragons are real, then Santa's real. Fuck you, bitch. Hold up. To... Since we're getting to the holidays. Fags? How about... Backtrack? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, backtrack? Just want to let everybody know. When did you dragons guys find out that Santa wasn't real? Bro, I was fucking 10 years old when I found out because I saw my dad's foot. <laughs> <laughs> Notice you that I said that shit with anger, bro. Huh? You saw you saw his what? I saw his foot. Damn. I recognized it too. <laughs> I was so mad, bro. I noticed those uncut t- uh, toenail the clippings. hairy right? ass feet. <laughs> those brown ass feet. <laughs> Santa, you're, I thought you were supposed to be white. That dude tried to run back to his room and trip. <laughs> <laughs> I do it. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine, bro. I can just imagine your dad and he, he just got sunned. Put, just, putting the know. gifts under the tree. No, and you're put, like Santa. Oh shit, that's me. And twisting his ankle. Bro, Wait, how I, I could just see your dad like angry as fuck, just putting the <laughs> putting the presents down, just like he's like, oh. finally, como chingan estos niños? Teacher Water in the Xbox, I got him a a helicopter. <laughs> Yo, hey, hey, hey! I got him a helicopter that blew up. <laughs> Best Christmas gift <laughs> ever. <laughs> gotta go back oh, all right i was 10 years old when i found out he wasn't saying <laughs> oh. you i think i was damn i don't know i don't remember the age but i remember i, <laughs> I remember i stayed up late you were gonna catch that bad oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you left some cookie traps <laughs> come on motherfucker come on i've been watching no. wwe so i know everything mm-hmm. And then uh, I remember staying up, and then I remember just, like, I had, like, my door open a little bit. And I think it was, like, dude, it was late. I feel like the parents always, like, do it late, like, super late. (laughs) Of course. And then (laughs) I remember seeing my mom, my mom, like, putting down presents. And also, I feel like I remember seeing, like, presents in their closet. (laughs) (laughs) Like, whoa! What is all Santa came early! (laughs) Bro, I remember one time... When I used to live in the condo with my with my dad, my brother, and my mom, mm-hmm. one day on the twenty fourth, right? Damn, there was a knock. A day on, before, <laughs> they had, uh, there was a knock on the door, and my dad's like, "Guys, guys, guess what? Santa came early and gave you guys one gift." <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, "Well, the fat bastard came early." <laughs> I, <right. laughs> 
You were the first on the list, huh? What the guess, I do this guess, year? <laughs> guess we were extra nice this year. And uh, I remember <coughs> after that, bro, I kept on telling my dad, I'm like, do you think Santa's going to come on the 24th again? And he give us one present? <laughs> and he'd be like, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> and after that, then I started getting suspicious. Because, bro, like, that condo was only one bedroom, right? <laughs> so, like... You feel someone get <laughs> <laughs> You be laying in the same <laughs> bed. No, same no, bed, bro. <laughs> no, because like, so when you entered the condo, right? You entered the condo. Yeah. If you took a right, you go into the living room area. And it was a big living room, bro. So it was kind of like what this is right here. So in this area, this would be my brother, my brother and I room. Yeah. But we had like a curtain, like a. I'll go to make it pretend like it was a room, right? Okay. The rest of it was a living room. If you go a little bit to like to the left. Down the middle was the kitchen, and then to the right, then you got to the fucking bedroom and to the fucking bathroom. <clears throat> so, like, technically, bro, like, whenever I would hear them, like, moving and stuff like that, I remember it was just easy, bro. It was, like, literally just us waiting for Santa. Mm-hmm. And then I just remember seeing my mom. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> <laughs> bitch ass to be towing. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? <laughs> hey, you're not the fat man. <laughs> I think she tried playing it off. She's like, mijo, it's gay. Santa needed help. Yeah, Santa needed help. <laughs> he, came, I, he, he dropped off the presents like two weeks ago. And I remember I kept on asking for a phone, dude. I kept on asking for a phone. What, you were going to call Santa? No, no, no. I kept on asking for a phone for me. Oh, okay. Like as, a, as, a gift. As, a, as a gift. He was going to call the North Pole. <laughs> but that's what I thought. <laughs> and, um, and then I realized. I got to complain. <laughs> year after One year. gift. Sorry, sorry. A sorry. day early? <laughs> I mean, come on. Why didn't you show up this year? That, um, <laughs> but I remember I kept on asking for a phone. Dude. I'm like, I really want a phone. And he never he never slid through with the phone. So then I started thinking, well, Santa wouldn't do me dirty like this. <laughs> <laughs> There's only two people that I can think of that can do me fucking dirty like this. And I know exactly who the fuck to look at. <laughs> and I remember I just I would ended up finding the presents in their fucking bedroom and shit like that. And I think yeah. I was probably like maybe nine, ten years old, same thing. Mm. Maybe, uh, <laughs> actually, no, I think I was like eight. Eight or nine years old when I found out that Santa wasn't real. And mm. I remember I was trying to tell my brother, like, hey, yo, man. This guy ain't real, bro. <laughs> you believe this shit? They've been lying to us all. Let, let me know. find out now. The tooth fairy ain't real? Who's slipping the five dollars <laughs> under my pillow, man? Who took what, my fucking the Easter phone? bunny isn't real? You telling me he didn't shit in my grandma's lawn? And I opened up and there's a dollar? Huh? Who's doing this shit, man? I apologize to the listeners. <laughs> I've been lied to my whole life. With dragons. Santa. Dragon Yo, Santa. Easter bunny. That shit broke fairy. my heart. Dude, when I saw my dad. Dragons weren't real? <laughs> really? On the, the you know, an- another moment, too, was, like, we would have, like, family parties. And, you know, like, I feel like Mexicans, they don't open, like, their, their gifts until, like, at 12 a.m. Yeah, yeah uh-huh. You know, so, like, you're with them, like, Christmas Eve. Mm-hmm. And at 12 a.m., you open gifts. And I didn't you, have that shit. No. <laughs> so I and have, you, I um, have a family. You, you know, you have the baby Jesus, and you're going like this. No, that wasn't me. Anyway, but sometimes, like, Santa would come. All right. Oh. But it wasn't Santa. Oh. It was yeah. my Tio Ivan. <laughs> <laughs> bro, bogus, I'm, like, right? I'm like, I thought Santa was supposed to be white, bro. Why you... Why, why you still dark as fuck? Why you smell like mechanical? <laughs> why your fingernails dirty? Why your breath smell like Dos Equis? <laughs> <laughs> why do you have to kill on the other hand? Oh my god, bro. Why are you so skinny, man? Oh, well, Miss Claus ain't feeding you here. Take all the cookies, bro. bro. It's crazy. Well, we're talking about Christmas, but I think Thanksgiving should get some love too. I would want a black Santa. <laughs> what, bro? No, it was just complete. <laughs> complete <laughs> to what I said. Canceled. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I feel like having a black Santa would be so much cooler than having a white Santa. The old fuck, dude. I don't know. He's weird. I just want dragons to be real, bro. bro get the <laughs> fuck up, bro. If you're not about the cause, don't shut your fucking mouth, you little fucking weasel. 
But yeah, Thanksgiving, bro. Everybody oh, fucking fuck disrespects. <laughs> everybody fucking disrespects Thanksgiving. Just I mean, disrespects. Dude, everybody skips it. I don't skip it. I'm on channel, dude. <laughs> everybody else skips it. Yeah, they go straight to like the hot, like Christmas, Christmas. No, oh. because like right, right when they, right when Halloween is over, Christmas music, the Christmas decorations are going up. Everybody's selling a fucking tree out of their ass. <laughs> No one gives a fuck about the turkey, man. You know, we should probably put a small tree here. Oh, we should, That'd right? be cool. Yeah. yeah. Remember that black tree you used to have? Or do Bro, you still have it? I still have it, but like the top lights won't work anymore. Yeah, it's giving up. Yeah, we have, we we have to have put a tree. Uh, <laughs> you know why? It's because we haven't put enough Christmas spirit into it. <laughs> Bro, oh, fuck. hey yo, I can lie. That shit was kind of gay, bro. I'm, I'm sorry. Three. Cancel. Cancel. <laughs> Can't say that. Wait, what were you gonna say? I forgot. What was I gonna say? What uh, were we talking about? about Thanksgiving. Yeah. Oh, that you like to munch out. Uh, what? Yeah. No. <laughs> no. I was, hey, oh, oh. I was gonna say, yeah, like for Christmas, like uh. for a Christmas special. Can I dress up as Santa and you guys can sit on my lap and then you guys can I'll be, dress up I'll as be a an elf. I'll be an elf, I call it. Thanks. And you can be Mrs. Claus. <laughs> <laughs> or you can be R- Rudolph. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we'll figure it out. I'll be Santa. You can I'll be the like... Grinch. No, Dude, I'll be the yes. Grinch. Oh, you can be the Grinch. Okay, bet. Should Thank I you. be the Crip Santa or the Blood Santa? <laughs> then I'll just be Jack Frost. You said you are going to be like the that. elf, bitch. Well, you guys are doing, like, main characters. I'm just fucking <laughs> yeah. elf. Yeah. Right. Well, there can't be two. There can't be three main characters, bro. It's a it's a main guy and a villain, all right? I'll pick one. You either well, the... Go as Jack. Go as Jack. You could be Sam. No, bro. Go as Grinch. He was supposed to be my elf. Hey, you could be um my dog. <laughs> <That's> my dog. <laughs> oh, wait. No, you could be his dog because he's the Grinch. What's his name? Pluto? No, it's um Max. 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 Pluto. <laughs> the disrespect. Yo, for real. My bad. I didn't like the Grinch because he was so grumpy. Bro, I can't wait to have kids and surprise them as the Grinch. And be like, I'm gonna take it. Instead of Santa, you're gonna be the Grinch. <laughs> Yo. Dude, I can't wait to have kids and tell them there's no gifts. Wow. But that's surprising. But that's surprising. Oh. I just want them to cry their eyes out. <laughs> yeah. Ah! See? I'd be like, Wait hey. till you go to Allegras. Then you ain't gonna get shit. <laughs> Bro, no, I feel like your mom is going to spoil the shit out of your kids, and she didn't spoil the shit out of you. No, yeah, I know. That's how she, it works. She's going to like, me, see you, host. <laughs> you good? That's how it works, bro. Bro, uh, did I tell y'all what my mom told me a couple oh, couple you. weeks ago? <clears throat> Obviously, the, the PS5 is the hottest thing out right now, right? Everybody wants to get the PS5. Oh. So, when I first got my PS5, it was probably oh, like bro. maybe last year. Maybe a month after it came out, my boy at AT and T, he hooked it up. He got me the PS Five, paid fifty extra dollars for it, six hundred flat. I came home that day, fucking super happy, bro. I was literally like coming in my pants. Mm-hmm. Not like not actually, yeah, I was. And um, they were giving me shit, bro. They're like, why? Why did you buy that? Why so much money? This and that. Who and was I, giving you shit? My my brother, and my mom. Oh okay. And I was like, bro, blow me. Uh, this is me. <laughs> this is my gift. Yeah. This is probably going to be the best thing I'm going to get all year. And um, my mom comes up to me. She's like, Sebas, I need to talk to you. I'm like, what's up, mom? Drew brother. Drew brother? <laughs> Drew, Drew brother. You know, he's been telling me that he really wants the PS5. And I'm like, okay, good luck. <laughs> and she goes, no, no, Sebastian, no. Drew brother? <laughs> Drew brother. Yo, I was thinking maybe you and me could split it half and half. You find it, and I will give you half the money. No, he sounds German. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like... A little bit Russian. And I was like, bro, are you fucking kidding me? I want a fat one. It's a fat one. I want him. <laughs> uh, but, like, I was like, bro, are you fucking kidding me, bro? You know what I get every year for Christmas and for my birthday? Calzones. Yeah, and socks. And I keep telling him, bro, get me something that I'll actually enjoy. I thought you were going to say something I actually use. <laughs> <laughs> bro, actually, I need. A couple of years ago, I had a snowblower. Bro, oh my God, it was the best. She ended up selling the snowblower. And I was like, you do know where the fuck we live, right? 
<laughs> I'm like, we don't live in fucking Arizona where it snows once every 30 years. We live in Illinois where it snows probably every 15 minutes. And then it gets sunny and then it snows again. And then it rains. And then it rains, bro. I'm like, you know, you do know where we live, right? And she was like, yeah, but we don't really use it. I was like, what do you mean we don't fucking use it, bro? I fucking use it. <laughs> so the, for the next three or four fucking years, bro, I had to shovel the fucking whole driveway, the whole fucking sidewalks because my mom felt bad for the fucking mailman. He knew what he was signing up for, goddammit. But of course, I fucking do it, right? A couple weeks ago, my mom's like, I got a big surprise for you. I'm thinking, what could it be? She goes, it's in the garage. I'm like, well, shit, baby, it's the cruise. <laughs> she got it back. It's back. Nah, she opens up the garage and she goes, I got you a snowblower. And I was like, okay. She's like, yeah, I know you've been asking for it for years. So I got you one. So now you could use it during the winter. It's your early Christmas gift. You are, know what, are you fucking? Are you that fuck, does suck. Are you well, fucking kidding nice. me, bro? No, dude. I get it. Yeah, it's gonna be handy. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. It's okay. gonna be handy as fuck. <laughs> but it's like buying a Mexican a leaf blower for his birthday. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What am I supposed to do Some, with it? A tortilla holder. It's like buying a comal, you know, <laughs> so, so I can cook better, bro. Listen, I get it. I it's what I need. But sometimes a player just needs, you know, a gift. An actual gift. You know what I'm saying? Like, give me something cool. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get shirts. I'm getting Which socks. Mind. I'm getting socks and sweaters. boxers, bro. I feel like sweaters is what I get now. Dude, I wish I could get that. If I get socks and boxers one more fucking time, I'm shooting this family. <laughs> wow. Canceled. And I'm shooting Santa canceled, when he gets canceled, here. Canceled, canceled, I'm shooting Santa for doing me dirty. And I'm flying away in my dragon. <laughs> Listen, if Santa doesn't show up under my fucking tree this year with a fucking dragon, I am shotgunning his knees off. Dude, I can already see, like, a shirt. This is this is Seb's perfect shirt, okay? It's Black Santa riding a dragon. Ooh. Merch coming out soon. <laughs> For the holiday season. Don't and he's like, he's like, and he has, like, a bowl. You know what I'm saying? Like what? he's got, he's got a, he's riding it like a bull, uh, you know what I'm saying? So he's got his Santa hat off, and he's like he's got a blunt in his mouth, <laughs> and he's just like <laughs> riding the dragon like that, bro. That's exactly how I want it. And then in the front of the shirt, dragons. I think we should end it just like that. <laughs> With Sebastian, thank you for advertising your shit. Oh. App, don't fire me. <laughs> Dragons are fucking real. And mom, if you're watching this, no fucking socks and no fucking underwear. All right, I want an actual gift. You good? And if, and if I swear to God, I do. If I don't get any of this shit that I've been asking for in this fucking yeah, podcast, I, got I, got I am shotgunning everybody in the fucking knees. That's brutal. Yeah. Don't forget the GoFundMe page on one two three dragonsarereal dot com. Thank you. <laughs> <to> go find me. <laughs> it's dragonsarereal.org. The link is in the bio. <laughs> <laughs> we'll put it down below. We'll put it down below. Also, wait, did you ever watch Dragon Tales? Yeah, of course. Fuck All of our social media links are gonna be down below. Jesus. I hope you guys enjoy the video. <laughs> this is our first uh, <laughs> podcast, but not really. Please support dragonsarereal.org and then support this channel. Los compadres. I got three followers. And Again, I've had that COMP. Page open since 2016. <laughs> o D R E S. C-O-M-P-O-E-D-R-E-S. 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 I can't find some. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, All guys. Right. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks, guys. We love you. I miss you. Don't leave me. Oh man. Are you with me? That's funny. Bro, this this podcast this podcast does not Dude, this is not a <laughs> This is not a record. I'm shotgunning both of you in the fucking knees. This is not our fault. From the back and one from one from the back and one from the front. Oh shit. Oh no, stop. Oh shit. It's over, guys. Go home.
That's it. Click the X. Yeah, for real. Go. Click on another fucking video. Go back on TikTok. <laughs> for real? Go, go back on TikTok? <laughs> go back on Pornhub, bro. Hey, if also, you find wait. real pictures of a dragon, send them to Wait, 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 wait. To all my kings out there, I failed. But continue oh. on. Continue on. No, no, November, all right? <laughs> Please. Thank you. All right, y'all. Peace. I feel like I look like that meme, the Mexican meme. Of a little kid, he's like... <laughs>